Profitool firstly. In this video I'll be walking you through Profitool and showing you how the latest version of the platform works. So Profitool has five parts to it which I'll be running you through today. Profitool Web, the Profitool Chrome extension, the Profitool mobile apps, Profitool deal sheets and then our Discord community. So we're going to start off with the web version of Profitool. So we're going to head over to the account page. Now it's important to remember that this is designed for mobile use, but I'll be showing you um, the web version. You can analyze using this. So this is the track page. So this is the deal analyzer. Now most people will use our Chrome extension or the mobile apps to use this, but you can also do it on web and it also works on mobile. So I'll just run you through everything we've got and we're adding new features all the time. So in, in here is where you obviously insert the ASIN. In here is where you enter the price you're buying the item for. When you put an ASIN in here, it will then load up all the data on the product. You can adjust the selling price here to see the price at different points. And then you've obviously got all the data points here. Now, when I move on to the Chrome extension, I'll go through this in a bit more detail and I'll show you an actual product. So this is the actual track page if we was to click scan on a mobile this would load the camera and then we have scan history so this will show you all the products you previously scanned so if you want to do some analyzing at a later date or if you've sort of forgotten what you're looking at it's also connected up to the mobile app so if you've scanned on your phone in a shop if you then want to go back home and do some more analyzing of the deals you can do that easily here and then next up we have the deal sheets section so I will do a separate part for deal sheets but this is where you download your deal sheets and where you subscribe there's a little video here which explains how it all works now we are in the process of looking to move deal sheets over to digital currently it's obviously a deal sheets file which is a CSV file um, but we are looking to make it actually so it's all within the portal next up we have links to our app so you've got the iOS app here the Android app here, Chrome extension here, so that will take you to links to, to download all of them. Then we've got the community section, so this will take you to our Discord chat. I will do another part of this video explaining that. And then we've got our help guides, which I'll just show you quickly. So these are guides which should have every answer you need. If not, you can submit a request and our support will get back to you in a short amount of time or you can even ask in the Discord community. Um, and then up here we've got the account part, so we've got settings. So Profitool works in four countries at the moment and we are looking more to add more soon. So we have the UK, the United States, Canada and India. You get use of all of the countries on your subscription. So not that most people will be using it in different countries, but for whatever reason you might be, within the subscription you get use use of all the different countries and then next up we have the account page so this is obviously your hub for payments so you can update your card details here um, and you can see all your invoices you can also update your username within here as well so that's the web based version next we'll move on to the profitable chrome extension so the Chrome extension works in two types of ways. So there's websites we're integrated with. This means we can automatically load the product or find the product. And then there's websites where you use the manual search option. Both are very easy to use, but over time we will try and integrate with just as many websites as possible. So if you've got a website that you'd like us to integrate with just to save you time, just drop us an email and we'll look to get that added. So I'm just on the clearance section here on Argos and I'm just going to show you how it all works. So we can have a look at this mouse. So it's £7.49. So all we have to do is if we just load up the Chrome extension here. And as you can see, automatically it's already given us the options for that product. Now, obviously, when we're searching on a website like Argos, we can't know the exact product on Amazon so that's why we give you the option so by the looks of it that one there we'll put that in there you'll see it automatically pulls the price as well and then all we do is we click calculate and there we are so this isn't a very good buy but we can just run you through it just to show you how everything works so next to here we've got the profit the estimated profit, so that's just linked up to there. We just moved this here just so you get sort of a quick look of whether it's a good buy or not. 
Um, so you've obviously got the ASIN part there. The info part here, so you've got all the product information, the sizing, the weight, the brand and manufacturer, what category it sits in the ASIN. There's also a link here to view the product on Amazon. Estimated sales are here, so we do a sales range just to give you a good understanding of how much the product is selling each month and you can use this alongside the price graph which I'll show you shortly um, just to analyze your deals. Um, this is a new feature we've recently added so you can now recalculate um, the different price points. So for example if we wanted to see what the profit would be at £20 instead we just do that, click recalculate and as you can see everything gets updated so now it would be a great buy um, and then we can just reload that just to see what it actually is. Um, so next we've got the data points here. So you've obviously got the estimated FBA fee. Um, that's how much you're paying for Amazon to ship it out for you and for everything like that. Then we've got the referral fee. That's how much you're actually paying to Amazon just to be selling on Amazon. Um, the estimated VAT, that is the VAT you pay on the fees. The break even point. So this is the point where you need to, you'll get your money back basically. So it'd be 11, you'd have to sell this at £11.66 to get your money back. Uh, your ROI, return on investment, so minus 56% is a good one. Your estimated profit per unit, so this is just using the FBA fee, referral fee, and the VAT. This doesn't include, you know, you, there are some other costs like your shipping um, into Amazon, but that is something we're looking to add in the future. Um, product reviews will tell you how many reviews it's got, so we can see here this has got a ton of reviews. Amazon sales rank, so this is the um, sales rank on Amazon, so this is 55,000. Um, then we've got the price graph. So if we just click that, now this is probably one of the most important pieces of data. Um, so not much going on on this price graph, but you can basically look for trends. So, you know, we'd be looking at the sales rank line just to make sure it is selling. Um, and then obviously the buy box line just to see what the old buy box price is. Make sure you're not going to get undercut. I mean, we can see Amazon is on the listing there. Um, but we also display the other sellers. So um, we can see Amazon is on this listing. There isn't any other FBA sellers. Um, and then there is two FBM sellers on this listing. And then we have a traffic light system for our rating. So we have a uh, good buy, average buy and poor buy, um, just to give you a bit of an indication of whether you know it's gonna be a good investment or not. This one's obviously a poor buy. And then finally, you've got the hazmat. So this will tick on if it's a potential hazmat. Um, and then also potentially oversized as well. So obviously if we detect it's gonna be an oversized one, so FBA fees are gonna be increased, these will light up. Um, and then we'll just finally head on to the search function. So you can do this for absolutely anything. Um, you know, most people will use this for websites we're not integrated with, but say you were selling a TV, you just put TV in there, and then you'd click that find product, this will load up a product and then you can just do it that easily. And then you just load load the data just like that. And what you can also do as well, so you can make this smaller, so while you're searching through your website, so if you do that, you'll see it then disappears. And then you can load it back up then. And if you click X, you'll see if you click Shift and P, that will load the widget up again. So that's how the Chrome extension works. So next up we have the Profitable mobile app. So this is available on both Apple and Android. All the data is exactly the same. The only difference is you get a camera scanner. So you can scan the barcode of any product and that will automatically pull the product data. You then just enter the purchase price and we'll load up all the data for you so you can analyze all your deals. So then moving on from there, we've got the find products page. So this is for a manual search. So if you wanna use the title instead, or if you don't have the product handy, you can use this to analyze your deals or if you just can't find the product. And then moving on from this, we've then got the scan history feature. So this is connected to your web version and the extension. Then we have the account page. So this is just where you can see the details of your subscription and the contact details. We then have the account page. Within here, you can change your country. So you get access to the UK, the US, Canada, and India. And then moving on from this, we have the community link. So if you head here, you can join our Discord community, which has just over 1,100 people in it. You then got further links down the side for a walkthrough video, a contact us, and then this is our help portal 
just here. So that is how the mobile app works. Deal sheets. Now deal sheets are obviously optional, so you don't have to use them. Lots of people do, but also lots of people don't. But they're just a great way of helping you find deals. So the concept of deal sheets is just putting all deals in one place. So deal sheets aren't a checked deal service. It's all scraped data. Um, but it's just to save you time trawling through websites. So we put all the information in one place for you. So let me just run you through how they work. So when you're in your account, either on your computer or your phone, you just click head to your deal sheets tab just here. You can see we are currently subscribed. Now we do deal sheets for the UK and the US and are looking at adding more countries soon. So to load your most recent deal sheet, you just click download just there. And that will load up and I'll just pull this into the main screen. Here we are. So these are the deal sheets. Now these get updated on Tuesdays and Fridays. So we put a message in our Discord when these get updated. I have mentioned previously in the video that we are looking to put these on a web-based version so there will no longer be a spreadsheet. Um, but currently they're all separated into tabs. So you see you've got all the tabs down the bottom here for the different uh, potential deals. So if we just click Toys and Games, you get the uh, product link, product name, Amazon link, Amazon name, the ASIN, the purchase price, the Amazon price, and the sales rank. And there's absolutely tons of deals on here. You know, this is just the toys. If we was to go into health and personal care, there's usually lots on here as well. And all the categories are filled with deals. So they're a very, very popular option. Finally, we have our Discord community. So I can't show you the inside, but at the time of recording, we have almost 1,200 members in there. And it's a fantastic community of sellers and a great place to learn at BA. We do also do a feature called Deal of the Day within the Discord, where we usually post two or three deals, which we find from our deal sheet or from online. And we post them Monday to Friday. Um, and it's just to give you a bit of inspiration of the type of deals out there. Um, so that is the walkthrough of Profitable. We thank all our current users and all our f future users as well. Um, and we really look forward to helping you on your FBA journey.